What is poppin' y'all? Welcome back to another requested reaction video. So we are about to get into this Nile being more Irish than Ireland. So without further ado, guys, we're just gonna hop straight into this video. So let's go. Do you get back to Ireland much? Is that, do you cause a huge sensation when you go back? Is it Mullingar? Yeah, Mullingar, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I go home like a couple of times a year. I get, uh, <laughs> my dad still lives in the same spot. <clears throat> so it gets kind of hectic around the house. Mullingar's a great spot. It's quite a small, traditional Irish town. Every time I hear the Irish <laughs> accent, I just think about beer. Oh, let's go, let's crack. Everyone knows each other. Oh, what's the crack? All right, all right, see it. <laughs> all right. Don't say that. Potato. Thanks, Niall Beautiful. He's his nice blonde hair. Oh, yeah. His Irish accent oh, and his yeah. carefree personality. Yes. Carefree Liam. personality. Liam, good answer. I like, the, I like this, Ireland. OK. These hats. That works. It's very... <laughs> Last night, that? boys. <laughs> no, don't, I don't want to see you okay. crying tomorrow. Bennett, you crying? Don't cry, don't cry, honestly. Look, beer. Look, beer. More beer. What a game. <laughs> what a game. <laughs> it's a great game. Mm. Really. So, for all the Derby County fans out there. Got another beer. Big three points today. 3-1 against Brentford. Edge is a Brentford fan. He's absolutely fuming with me. He won't talk to me all day. Soji. Soji. It's the last night. How do you feel? Flute. Flute is the Irish word for penis. <laughs> Huh? Where did you, you get? Are firmly wrong. Because it means penis. You're welcome. <laughs> the morning after. Are you the night sure about before. that, or did you just make that up? How are you doing, Jerry? <laughs> Hello, guys. Just want to say a massive thanks for <laughs> last night. Thanks for voting for me uh, to win Best New Artist. I uh, really enjoyed the performance as well. I had a great, great fun. Met some really cool people. Uh, great night all round. On to feet. What is Niall Horan's favourite drink? I absolutely love Guinness. Yes. We are Irish, and we live up to every single stereotype. Why don't you sound Irish when you sing? Because I know sometimes what I'm when about. you talk, I can't understand you. Sometimes and when I, I talk, I can't understand myself. You <laughs> I know what I'm talking about. Like, beer. Irish beer. I know what I'm saying. Guinness is my favorite. <laughs> Still talking about the Sweet Guinness? Nectar. I don't even want to talk about it. It gets me emotional. <laughs> what? When I wake up, well, I know I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be the man who wakes up next to you. Uh, anything next to add? You. No, I don't. I've never done that. I've no, I don't. Hey! <laughs> Let's be honest, we've got some very fond memories of each other. We loved each other when we were kids. Like the time you pushed me off the tractor, I split my head off the marble on the mantelpiece. We played in every uh, corner of the globe over the last 18 months or so, and no show's been boring, every show's been different. and and you guys made it extra special and uh, it was a really fun time and we're all going to miss it big time reality sometimes like you'd be in there and you'd be like as there's kind of like the backpacking thing there you'd be buying like a pint you know be buying a pint for two or three of the lads and then you know the barman would be going oh lads. someone's doing all right and he's doing good <laughs> it's like it's only a few pints i don't know if it's, uh, it makes any difference lassies and lads <laughs> I love how proud he is. It's an Irish party, we ain't going home. You wanna keep me up? But hold my home. We'll drink a few when we be on our back. Now everyone in here, stand up and clap. Clunners are taught to Asher and Grand. Do me a favor. We took a shot. Well, I know I'm gonna be, I'm 
I'm gonna be the man who goes a long way. And when I get drunk, well, I know I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be the man who gets drunk next to you. Then, about three weeks later, I split Greg open with a, te a table tennis bat. There right, there, right there, right there. Right there. On that note, uh, to Greg and Denise. <laughs> I haven't really been out of the house the last couple of days. Uh, been trying to rest up after being sick. Um, went out today, hit a few golf balls just to get out of the house, um, clear the head a little bit. But, what I gotta say, it is quite strange driving around London, seeing your face absolutely everywhere. Kinda don't mind it though, because I do have an album out Friday, so I actually don't mind seeing my face around for a weird. change. I don't know if I'll though. ever get used to that. <laughs> Just chilling out. Hearing your box. voice on the radio and seeing your face everywhere. Like, I don't know. So yeah, but yeah, like it's good. I get to go home and you know go see the lads and stuff like that, and see the family. And it's yeah, I like I like that side of it. Um, but yeah, it's Miss Ireland. Obviously, would like to go there a lot more. But. Are they trying to avoid the Nobody police? Nobody told us for the last five years that Ireland have the best crabs. I grew up in Ireland where it rains for three. I thought he said the best crabs. <laughs> Here's my favourite tweet of the night. Can you please do your best Irish dancing? Welcome home now. Put it out the back. Here we go. Give me something to take with. It's the song for me. Do you think anyone knows I'm Irish? <laughs> bogger. I am a bogger. If you're from Dublin, you think that Dublin is the only place that exists in Ireland. When the tourists go to Ireland, they tend to just stick to Dublin. Oh my god, I love Temple Bar. I go there for a Guinness, even though it costs 11 dollars. 11 pounds, euros even. For it is so Guinness. weird to me when people can turn their accents off like that. from outside of Dublin that live in the country, and they're called Culchies. Is that an American accent? God what knows. was that? And Bogger. So <laughs> you live in, you're meant to live in Bogland. West Palm tomorrow, and then after that we're, we're all headed home, back to London, uh, for a day or so, and then over to Paris for me. Reality hits, everyone's just kind of like, what do we do now, blah, blah, blah. Like the potatoes in Ireland? I like all things Irish. Irish dancing? Irish. Dance moves. <laughs> oh, you already got enough That's what I do now. Now Lauren is here. Let's be honest, Ireland is the best country in the world. <laughs> is this one thing he gonna do? He gonna dance. Exactly. Uh, no. Very <laughs> <laughs> good. Okay. Now. Um, so, Ibrahim, you would say, Tommy, a cackle mavrishti. <laughs> Tommy, I, d I know what that means. Yeah, but if you, if you are, you're nervous for this moment because you don't want to mess it up on live radio on the national broadcaster. So, Tommy, a cackle mavrishti. Tommy, a cackle mavrishti. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, y'all, that was my reaction to this video. If you guys enjoyed my reaction, please make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in my next reaction video.